What's good, YouTube? It's your boy CPT, the farmer. We back. Okay, guys, I have promised on my other previous video that I will be doing irrigation in here. Uh, today is the day, guys, where we install our irrigation. Uh, my irrigation is the most simplest irrigation you could ever uh, come out with. Uh, it's cheap. You don't need power. You don't need electricity. You don't need water pump. You don't need pressure. With my case, I'm using... Uh, a water from my tap i connect the wash pipe i will show you later uh, where i get the uh, the the water so here is uh from my previous uh, irrigation video my last video where i was connecting everything and uh, you can watch that video where you can see how uh, i cut the pipe and yeah so but in this video i will be like uh, explaining it better so thank you and first of all with our irrigation we must have one pipe which is main line and from this main line we connect other pipe which they're going to drip but with my irrigation is simple because of i use only one pipe which is 15 millimeter poly pipe. Uh, I cut this pipe into pieces for the ripping pipe and for mainline pipe. My mainline can come into pieces just like that. Can come into pieces just like that. Just like that. See? So, from here to here, I cut this piece. And from here to that, I cut this piece. They don't even have to be the same size. Because of from here to here, and from here to here, it's not the same size. What I'm saying, you don't have to be accurate for this DIY irrigation system. Okay, I, as I said, I use only this one pipe. I cut the pieces that I want. Uh, the first pieces that I cut is the uh, for for dripping line, which is the, the 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 very same size of my bed, and also uh, to connect the pipe, we only use this thing, three thing here, which is a isometer, which is three T junction. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you how I connect this thing. And how easy it is. All right. This one, you just come here and connect. And here, you take your T what what connector. You put it. You put your drip. Put this one okay now we must connect a pipe here for this uh, race bit so let me get that pipe <laughs> Oops. <laughs> 
Okay. Okay, now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna connect a hose pipe that comes from my water tap. I'm gonna I'm gonna connect the hose pipe here and it's gonna distribute water from the water tap to uh, the irrigation pipe and it's going to drink. So let me get my hose pipe and I'll show you. Now my wash pipe is connected with my water tap. Uh, that's where the, the the main source from my water is my water tap. The water from my spal, by the way. So now I come here. I connect the wash pipe with my main line. Just like this. And soon it will be irrigating. Or drippy as you can see it's already starting i must come and adjust it all right to so connect uh, the wash pipe with the uh, irrigation pipe uh, the poly pipe aka my main line i use a uh, water reducer i use this reducer so it's going to uh, connect with uh, my diy main line pipe or yeah my irrigation pipe okay uh as you seen how i have installed it i hope you get the idea i don't know how to explain it better now let's get to these advantages of this thing okay uh as you can see these are packs these are for washing from the washing line and stuff so uh i use these packs to actually like uh, remember this pipe doesn't come with uh, dripping walls or dripping I don't know yeah dripping walls so you you pierce or you make your own wall so sometimes uh it is going to depend with the object you use uh, sometimes you can make a bigger wall so whereby now you're gonna have uh, too much water spillage like i have here so now i'm going to show you how to solve this problem uh, with that packs i'm able to solve a few problems but some are bigger they need a uh, uh, black tape but uh, you can also use plastic like me if you don't have the black tape it's gonna work just fine and also uh, for you to be able to control your water it's where uh, by your water tap you open it uh, when you open it uh, full is gonna come with pressure but when you open it less uh, it drips the way you want it i will show you later what i'm trying to say so after uh, doing the plastic this is how nice it's gonna drip uh, it works so this is how it looks uh, at the end i use these bricks to balance it uh remember this is a uh, temporary every time when i put the new crop i i remove uh, my irrigation so even here at makwala agri we use the same method of irrigation uh, this is the very same pipe size 15 poly pipe uh, this is how we currently dealing with uh, our um, dripping system which is a little bit challenge with our irrigation but it's working so far but in here our main line is a very bigger pipe uh, the size is bigger than uh, the one that is going to drip so here we use 25 size 25 so yes uh this is uh how he's been doing on our tomatoes yeah this is at makwala agri another project that uh, i do with my friend at his backyard your boy cpt the farmer i hope you get the idea of irrigation i'm out Danko.